Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is your favorite black person in the world, basically, uh, Maximus Black. Yeah, there's there are way too many white people for me to say the same thing. Yeah, no, there I really can't, is. I, I can, can't I can that. actually name about three right off the top of my head. Yeah, automatically. I can, I can name. I can more name favorite than you. Three off the top of my head. Yeah. Uh, my mom. Okay. Jesus. Chris Tucker. Wait, Jesus isn't white. So. Chris Tucker. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, he is he white? He's not white, you <laughs> asshole. <laughs> I thought I snuck that in there. Yeah. I thought I did it. I thought I had it. Okay, he's he's one of my favorite whitest sounding black men. What about Eddie Murphy? I don't think he sounds white. No? No. What about acting a little bit? He acts kind of white. I mean, he did have that, that pretty dope song, Party All the Time. Oh, that song is bios. If you guys don't know what Party All the Time is, you should you should. You go need to go to on that. YouTube right now. I don't even care if you have to just turn this video off to go do it. I don't know about your girl, but my girl likes to party all the time. Absolutely. Mr. Maximus Black. Yep. Hit me up at that party. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> party! I had no I actually had nothing in mind for that. I just wanted to see how you reacted. Okay. That's pretty good. Starting down here in the bottom position of Metalopolis, we have Good luck. Fur Nelyama. Alright, that was I'm gonna give you a, a, a seventy five. Thanks. On that. And up over here on the left position of <laughs> Metalopolis, we have Miss Master Chief. M Master Chief. Uh, that's a Master Chef, basically. Oh. The way that's spelled. I'm, I'm sure he. I'm sure it could have gone either way. Okay. He could be trying to be Master Chief, just spelled differently, but in this case... We're going to go Chef, then. He's Master Chef. All right. Good show. And we're going to call him Furt. That works. Furt. Uh, Furt Neloma. Furt... Fertnaluma. Fertnaluma. It's a stupid ass name change. Fruit of the Loom. You got that free name change, sir. Fruit of the Loom. I never wore. Did you ever wear Fruit of the Loom? Uh, no. Is it? Wait, isn't that underwear? It's underwear, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I was gonna say something really, really homo. No. And I just decided not to do it because that's it's gonna good, sound that's really a weird. Great if I did. That's a great decision. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Fruit uh, of the Loom, though, apparently not bad. Yeah, once again, I'm going to refrain from saying... Refrain. Yeah. Oh, I... I'm oh. not say anything. Oh, uh, I think I know where you were going with that, because okay. at first I thought you were going somewhere completely different. Okay. All right. Um, natural expansion going down here for uh, Mr. Chief. Surprise! And we do have four lings coming out the gate here, but we already have a couple of lings. He's going to be prepared for this. Yep. Uh, doing a nice little uh, bit of an extractor trick. And really, supplies are relatively the same. Expansion now going down for a furt. Uh, Queen is out, going to be able to get a free Overlord pickings. Nice. Does not uh, barf out that extra bit of larva, though, before he decides to go after this Overlord. I don't know if that's going to slow down his uh, his drone or ling production. Uh, he still would have been able to kill this Overlord if you would have just quickly barfed down there. So it's going to put him behind just a little bit, but there isn't even a Queen out yet. For, wow, those uh, lings are going to work. Yeah, they're going to work, but uh, these these well, it's not gonna, are going to It's not okay. going to shut it down, but the, the big thing there is in a ZVZ, you know, every little bit, uh, or any mirror matchup, any little bit helps, and look at the uh, the amount of damage they are able to do to that. Either he's going to have to let that go and hope that it can regenerate that much health, or he's going to have to waste queen energy to, to bring that back, because an early push, uh, a couple of early pushes could get rid of that expansion pretty quick. Okay, I'll, I'll give you that. I'm actually just overextending. There's no way in yeah. hell it's going to happen. Okay, thank fight. you. Yeah, I was just, I was just trying not to shut you down. There. No, no. I really don't think it's going no, down. No, it's not going to go down. No. no. Okay. Watch now that we said that's probably. It's gonna probably going to get destroyed. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> and by like one last link. One claw, last link close. Just, <laughs> and it's going to be gone. All uh, right, so Master <laughs> Chef chasing off uh, Furt here with uh, his greater link numbers. Of uh, one or be, two? No, I don't like one. No, oh, now okay. he's got now he's now got he's several like, more. Now yeah. he's okay. He's all right. Uh, so link speed going for both gentlemen oh. right now. It looks like Master Chef is ahead by about I don't know like three seconds. Uh, oh, that's send, unfortunate. Wow, send that right into the into the meat grinder there. Yeah. So it looks like uh, Furt's gonna want to go and uh, go head for head here, but that's not a battle he wants to uh, to engage in. No. And he's gonna bring over some more links. He's just kind of sending them into the into the meat grinder here. I'm not I'm not really sure, and he's just microing really poorly as well. Uh, queen is finally out. Do we have a second queen in production? Yes, we do. And actually, Furt putting himself in a good position there at the top of the ramp. Very nicely done. Uh, and these two lings are going to go down. He's going to pick off maybe a couple of these low health lings, and they're all going to go down with really doing no damage. Metabolic boost is going to finish for both players very, very shortly. 
Um, 16 links coming out here for MasterChef. I don't know if that was for defensive purposes and he just, I don't know, clicked the button one too many damn times or what that was. Kind of unnecessary. Um, both uh, gentlemen just having their layer tech finished. Roach Warren going up here now for MasterChef, so he's feeling uh, that he's going to want to do some uh, some Ling and Roaches. Hey, you know what? I think if uh, if Chef decides to go down and and poke and do a little bit of damage, I think I think he might be able to do a bit. Oh, whoa. Some well, free lings. No, this, this he does really not a, take them. This isn't a poke. It's just pretty much, I think, just scouting stuff. But he's left a smaller ling army back at home. Luckily, what are these players doing? Luckily, Ferd is sending in lings to, to death over and over again. And wow, this is actually going to be a decent amount of drone killing here by the looks of it. Yeah, gets four drone kills. Uh, very nice. Take a look at the drone count right now. 23 to, uh, to 30 for uh, Mr. Master Chief or Master Chef. So he's definitely uh, in the lead right now, economy-wise. 1,100 uh, opposed to, what, close to 800 a minute, so... No, that, that was, was a nice. good, well, that was was a good, good exchange. Yeah, it was a very good exchange Absolutely. For, uh, for Chief. And he was able to hold it back at home and, and continuing uh, the uh, kind of in nonsensical uh, tactics here by Furt. He continued to send up some more lings to die, not really getting any uh, more scouting information of any kind except for the fact that Master Chef still has more lings than he does. Um, back down here at home, he has a couple more lings in the mineral line there, probably for defensive purposes. He is getting his spire up. Uh, which will make things good, uh, pretty interesting if Master Chef cannot scout that. He's sending down a oh big, God. big army right now of Lings, and that Spire is a long way away from being finished. This could be game over right this now. This could be huge. This is a perfect timing attack. We are seeing a tech up here for Muta, but he was supply blocked and building a lot of Overlords at once, and this is just way too many Lings wow. from the handle. He's definitely at least going to lose this natural expand. The question is, is he going to be able to get up into this base quick enough and get rid of this Muta, but he at the just same time, even see it. He's only really going to be able to build four, maybe five Muta uh, if this comes out. And I really don't know if that's going to be enough. Well, I really don't know. The, here's the really, like, I mean, the really scary part here for uh, for Master Chef is that he just actually hasn't even seen that Spire yet. And he's been uh, blindly getting his roaches up without having seen what exactly his opponent's been doing. I don't even know. I mean, he knows that he's got layer tech at this point, obviously, but he doesn't know what he's doing with that layer tech. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, or layer tech if you don't like the uh, the accent of layer it sounds like layer of a cake we like to say it that way whatever layer know. layer tech down here we've got uh, that uh, spire up now and those mutas on the way so yeah but, um, yeah yeah, yeah. I, no, no, I agree because links and roaches no he, he's pretty blind right now but adam he lost his natural oh he, he got he got crippled yeah, hard. yeah he i mean he's he is he is hurting for squirting what am I doing? Whoa, really? Uh, he lost 10 drones, which actually, you know what, isn't as bad as I thought it was. But this is just a lot. He's just gonna, he might be able to just kill this base even before these mutas are gonna be doing too much. I mean, there's only, what, four mutas here. He can just keep, he's already got three queens on the field. We take a look here, and uh, this is just not looking good for, uh, for... Uh, Furt. No, just this a is a lot of damage. This is this is a terrible, terrible amount of damage. And uh, coming down here at a uh, great time as the Muta were leaving the base here to go back up, and they're actually it looks like they might be coming home to try and help out on the home uh, on the home front here. And look at the amount yeah. of death that has happened here. There's no coming back here for Furt. Yeah. Um, I did. I was, you know. It's sort of it's sort of that thing when you know you're you're Protoss and the Zergs got thirty roaches, and there's that one guy that's like. Only if you got a Stargate. Well, okay, <laughs> I could get two or three Void Rays, but my base is literally going to die. No matter what. No yeah. matter what. So it's one you can't of the, kill them fast Exactly. Enough. Sure, you got mutas, but this is just this is too many units. Yeah, no, at this point, uh, there's not a whole lot that he can do. He still retained his lair, and he has, uh, he has a, a reasonable amount. Well, it looks to be seven muta at this point, but the amount of queens on the field and the amount of spore crawlers going up here a free queen there. for Master Chef, I don't know if he's going to be able to do enough to make this really yeah. worth it. Oh, he keeps that muta alive just barely. He can do a lot of damage here, at least in terms of supply blocking his opponent and keeping the roach numbers down up until the point where he has anything to really threaten him. Uh, of course, at this point also like you were saying he could just send like a massive roach army down yeah and they wouldn't be able to get killed in time well here's the problem i mean i still first are out of this game but he's really making a horrible decision right now he's chasing roaches i mean what do you plan on doing do you what are you protecting here go in here and try to do as much damage he's not even building pick, drones pick off these queens try to get out take out drones supply block your opponent so he can't you know uh, bring lings down to your base He's really stretching here, and the more time he gives Master Chef, uh, the more spore callers are going to be down, the more defense, and just the more queens. It's, 
I mean, he's dead anyway, but, you know, he's just kind of, no. he's really taking a if bad situation and making it worse. Yeah, if you're going to stay in the game, um, yeah, you know, uh, at least take into consideration, you know, something that you, you know, did he just build wings? I think so. Did I see that happen? You did. All right. So, uh, if you were going to win this game, basically, forget Lings, get your drones back up, and just do as, literally, as much harassment as possible. He could have yeah. killed every bloody overlord... Pretty close that, to it. Yeah. That Master Chef had before these spore crawlers. But now went look up. at this. Now, now you've much. got four spore crawlers right here. You've got Queen with lots of energy, uh, and Master uh, Chef really isn't even isn't even microing at this point. No. Just and the hydras are out. So that's so. that's it. That's all she wrote. Yeah. So it was a it was a def decent ZVZ. I'm not sure what what league this is. I, I, if I had to guess, I would say like gold platinum. That's that's where I that's where I would pl uh, place it for sure. Yeah. Not, um, not but a bad for game. those for those watching, if you do find yourself in awkward situations like that, like Mr. Black was saying, sometimes um, it's it's best to just go with it because no matter what you do, you're going to lose something back home. Yeah. Just go with it and do as much as you can, and then if you do manage to survive, cool. Then you have to make really good decisions to work your way back up the hill. And in this uh, scenario, because of the lack of anti-air um, harassment on all fronts, getting rid of queens and getting rid of overlords takes huge precedent over killing the five roach running down to your completely destroyed base uh, and, and deal with them later. But uh, decent game anyway. Yeah, that's all I'll right. Take it. Yeah, I'll take, I'll it. take it. Hey, you know what? This, this last I'll couple of games it. better than some of the stuff that this is true. We've had over the last we, few weeks. We've had, we've had, we've it's had like worse. Been a big stale, dry spot where people are like, "This is the greatest game ever," and we get in there. It's really this is, and it is not the greatest game ever. No, not it's not even so bad that it's good for being the best game ever. Like it's it's yeah, in yeah. that awkward purgatory of being hideously mediocre to the point where you can't even make fun of it. Mr. Anyway, Maximus Black. Yeah. We have more recording to do. We do. Let's go do that. Mr. Uh, uh, Why, I almost repeated myself twice. I need to go to bed. Peace. Peace. <laughs>